It seems they're just a regular couple. Every night they have dinner together and discuss events of the day. However, one goal that they said after the trip to Ukraine makes them special. My church growing up started going to Ukraine when I was in high school. I got hooked after that first trip and went back multiple times and uh, finally took my husband with me um, after a few years so that uh, he could experience the culture there as well. Because we've been there, um, we felt like that God wanted us um, to look into adopting children there. Um, it's been on our hearts for a while, but we're finally in a situation to where we can start uh, fundraising to actually make it a reality. Ukrainian forces fight against separatists in the east of Ukraine. A lot of people from this region had to find new homes. And maybe, thanks to this couple, one child from Ukraine will find his way in the United States of America. It is definitely tougher for the eastern side of Ukraine. We would love to get children outside the war or to get them out of the war zone. Uh, currently, the government is stopping it. Um, and I presume it's just too dangerous to get the children out of the orphanages. The process of adoption is not only complicated, but expensive as well. The family has to organize numerous fundraisers to make their dream comes true. It's a lot of um, documents that have to be filled um, on the U.S. side and on the Ukrainian side. Um, a lot of fundraising. It's going to probably cost us, um, rough estimates are between 17000 and 20000 um, And it, it would be a lot more expensive um, if we did not have contacts inside of Ukraine that are willing to help us out. Um, so we've been blessed with that regard. Anyone who wants to donate can write a check to Troy Bush Memorial Baptist Church. Victoria Sabina, Troy, Trojan Vision News.